Hello everyone, my name is Rihanna and I'm a science communicator here at the Manitoba Museum and let's make some elephant toothpaste. Now we're not actually making toothpaste that you can use. Don't try eating this, but you can try making it at home if you have a few important things. To make elephant toothpaste, a beautiful puffy substance, you need some hair developer. Hair developer has hydrogen peroxide. Today I'm using 40 volume, which is 12% hydrogen peroxide. You also need a little bit of dish soap, some yeast for baking, just the same stuff you'd use for making bread, and a little bit of warm water. So let's get a half cup of our hair developer, our hydrogen peroxide, and get that into our tall container. And now we need a splash of our dish soap. Just enough to give a slight blue color on top of the liquid. And give that a stir. Perfect. And now for the most important part, our yeast. I'm going to take about a tablespoon of yeast and put it into my warm water and give that a stir. Hydrogen peroxide is made up of hydrogen and oxygen gas. If you were to write out the ingredients list, it would be H2O2. Hydrogen peroxide comes in brown bottles usually for cleaning off cuts and it's sold in brown bottles because light causes it to break down into water and oxygen gas. If you add yeast, which makes something called catalase, it makes that breaking down happen really, really quickly. That little dish soap we put in there makes it so our lovely breakdown of gas gets captured in foam. And what's a little foam without some fun colors? So today we're gonna make our toothpaste purple. Give that a swirl for some color. And now it's time for us to add our catalyst to get our beautiful puffy toothpaste. Here we go. And out of the bottle it comes as a squirt of foamy elephant toothpaste. If you'd like to learn more about different aspects of science, come visit us here at the Manitoba Museum in the Science Gallery and learn about some space in the planetarium. We're open Tuesday through Sunday from 10 to 4. Hope to see you here soon.